This is Dino Delio, Dino Delio Beauty, you know him. And you guys are doing a makeover today. You are making over the gorgeous Victoria. She is an environmental science student at Ryerson University and a horseback rider. Today she's just a glamazon though, because yeah. by the end of the show she's going to look so fantastic. All right, it's, it's time now to see our incredible makeover. You're going to love this one. So Victoria came in, hardworking student uh, in her last year doing environmental science, wanted a change. Well, <laughs> talk about a transformation from Joe, from student to runway, you look phenomenal. Oh my gosh, how are you feeling? Oh great, I feel fantastic. <laughs> We've all been awing, like ooing and awing all over her. I mean, you look incredible. I said don't take a nap before you see your boyfriend, okay? Because we need for him to see this whole look. Let's talk about the hair, Kevin. Yeah, the gorgeous yeah. waves. Victoria is a beautiful, beautiful girl and just as sweet on the inside. And so it was quite simple. Um, but we did lighten up, took a little bit of length off, about two inches off the bottom oh, you did. and then we did face framing layers as well as layers throughout so basically what it'll do is just lift up her entire style so it brightens her color and it right. just makes styling a lot easier for her see sometimes a little bit of a cut it, it just makes everything so much better I look it at the really before does. and there was so much more hair but it wasn't doing anything absolutely you can have hair but if you pull it back all the time which is sort of how Victoria came in she was and would what drew us to her, she just had to pull back in a low pony and she's just stunning. So right. we were like, we, we just need to zhuzh it a little. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> you did some great zhuzhing there. Thank you. Wonderful job. Okay, Dino, let's talk yes. about um, her gorgeous face. Yeah, she's just You were a little stunning. torn about what I'm going to do with her lips. Well, you made the right move. Yeah, I remember we were deciding That's we didn't good. know where to go. We wanted to sort of, you know, harmonize with the jacket, but I didn't want that on her lip. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, I mean, she's, we should call the modeling agency. Elmer Olsen should know about her. Let's just dial them know? up right now. Okay, right. let's she get the phone. Right now. So good. Yeah. What was your top? Oh, we have a little sort of tip to give. Yeah. So for okay, so you can see, you know, this whole craze of the hot contouring. Yeah. But what keeps to be uh, being forgotten about is highlighting. Highlighting is a lot easier to do. Okay. And and I'm going to show you to bump up your makeup and get this sort of effect. Take like an ivory shimmery eyeshadow and a large eyeshadow brush, and you just blend it all under over the top of the cheekbone, and then it blends in the top edge of your blush. Take it all the way, scoop it. We call it scooping. Mm -hmm. Scoop it all in there. And it really elevates and widens the face and elevates the eyes. And of course, she has the Tracy factor. Yeah. False eyelashes. Oh, so that's what you did. Yes. You tracy it up. I tracy it up. I love it. <laughs> so, you know, when you when it's contouring, you're trying to make things look farther away. And when you're highlighting, you you're want them to things look, out. you're bringing them out. So it's yeah. interesting. There's so much focus on contouring. And also, the terminology often is, in, is incorrect. Right. Sometimes they say contouring for highlighting. And it's, they're two different things. Right. Contouring means darkening and shaping. Highlighting means volumizing, making things look bigger. Okay. Yeah. I love that. 